Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Half-Life Source with MioXFu and well as you know I ran into a bit of a a bit of unforeseen consequences last time with my cooperative bit with Miss Splittable Infinitive in that I didn't save. Uh thankfully though, we can just start back here. Uh, if you remember, this is where we saw our first enemy who, without the crowbar, so we can't fight him. Blah, 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 blah. Complain, complain, complain. And we have the lasers and everything like that. Um, it's not too far back, so I might as well just keep going through it. Uh, I really can't remember most of what I was going to say now. Uh, whoa. You'd think they'd pr properly shoot these things so they wouldn't explode at the slightest bit of contact. No! Security guard gimming all over the place. Oh, there's our crowbar. And my favorite elevator in the world. You see, I pressed the button last time and they came flying down. I wonder. Yep. Oh no. <laughs> And explodes in a cloud of red dust. Well, not red dust, red fog. I'm sorry, guys. I wish I could have saved you. But there's nothing left. I can't even, like, freeze you guys in the hope that someone in the future will be able to rebuild you. <laughs> but anyway, might as well stop down there in order to get that, that power thing. Oh, hey, it's a little buddy. Die, zombie. Gordon. Little buddy. Man, am I glad to see you. What the hell are these things? And why are they wearing science team uniforms? I don't know. Couldn't be anything important, right? <laughs> I bet I bet they're just random zombies. Oh, come with me. Come with yeah, me. Yeah, we might stand a better chance if we team up. I don't think I'm gonna kill you this guy. You're like you're like You're like my guardian angel, you know? You've got you've got a gun. I don't have a gun. That target range time is gonna what about that target range time? You gonna s no? No? You're not gonna enlighten me? Okay. I'll just let you take care of these guys. How's it? Oh yeah. The target range time is really paying off. <laughs> and don't worry, man. We'll save you. You're dead, but we'll save your corpse from being desecrated. Better to be dead than to be a zombie. Uh, and we can always go back and check our locker. I, I know this is all... <laughs> what do you go through his locker? I know this is all stuff that I've done before, but I... There's no reason for me to... No, come on, I, ha I need to get help. There's no reason for me to... Go all the way through the game, but there's no reason for me to just meet you guys in a few minutes, because... It's not very far from here that we ended off, so... Anyway, I would like to apologize for not having recorded more of this yet. Uh, it's just that I've been busy, you know, doing what I do. You know, going to college, doing all that crazy, crazy stuff. Oh my god, explosions everywhere. Shut off the alarm at least. Jeez, that's annoying. We can never leave. And sorry guy, but you can't come with us. I need your gun. <laughs> You're just a video game character anyway. Okay. There you are, head crab. So, let me try this one more time. I'm sorry that I haven't been recording more of this lately, because I do love this game, and I want to record it as much as possible. And I want to go, No! Run, Mr. Scientist, run! Oh man, you got a bat can off of him. Way to go. Yeah, way to go. Oh, God. Sorry, man. I'm sorry. You deserve better than that. This guy deserves nothing more than 9mm, though. I'm sorry. But your family would have wanted me to do it, rather than have you sit there in epileptic seizure all day. <laughs> rather than seize the day. Oh my god, Final Productions. Oh, ex girl who hates that joke, but... Oh, I thought it was hilarious. What do we have to... Yeah, there... Uh... Let, me, let me... Let me... Let me through. Thank you. 
Jeez. Oh, and now you open all the way. Jeez. I love these guys. They do like little sonic booms, but don't, don't, don't let them get them off, because they'll hurt you. Vagina, head, face, <laughs> person. <laughs> you coming back, buddy? Oh, God. Come with me, mister. I'll save you. I'll save you from this horrible, this horrible fate that has befallen your comrade. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, shoot. Yeah, this is what they'll do. And if you're close enough, that will do quite a lot of damage, if I remember correctly. But they're pretty easy to take care of, so don't worry. Don't worry, everything is going to be fine. <laughs> uh, but no, I have been extremely busy this past week or so, because I have run into amazing success with my studies. Because I'm just looking at all the great papers I'm going to be writing. But most most of the problem has been coming from uh, my dealing with a bunch of jerks at my school in USG funding and dealing with my clubs and stuff. But also I ran into car troubles, so. But you don't want to hear about that. You want to hear about the game. Who am I to take you away from that? So yeah, you got to protect that guy to bring him up here. And he'll open this. I never suspected such things could be. What do you mean? They're aliens. You never suspected that aliens could exist. Would you never read sci-fi novels or something? It's pretty silly for a scientist. Come on, can you come down here? No? Alright, we'll take your buddy then. Your buddy that looks like, uh... Who does he look like? I don't know. <laughs> I know he looks like someone, um, but I can't think of who. Wait, is this the door that gets... Yeah, it is. Boom! Love that. Just the anticipation of not knowing what's coming through. Especially because that's the first Vortigaunt you meet, and then you're like, okay, okay. He's not a zombie. And then he shoots you with the, the ray beam, and it's like, oh god. What have we fallen into? Hello there yourself. You didn't you didn't spend time with me last time, man. It's not cool. You, you didn't want to share in my fried chicken ice cream, fried chicken leg ice cream. That was the most ridiculous thing. Oh man. All right. So come over here. Raise the water level. We should be good. I think you can open this. I think you can go through both of them. You don't have to open that one, but it's closer. I don't really like spending time in the water in this game because it's just not fun. All right, this conveyor, conveyor belt is going to be fun because I showed you guys last time. You can just wait for these guys to go down and they'll just slide down that way. You can actually wait too, I think, and wait for it to go all the way down and just slide down. Oh wait, no, it does hurt you. Whoops. <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh well, no big deal. I'm so bad at hitting these guys, jeez. <laughs> it's like, it's like head crab, it's like head crab uh, batting practice. <laughs> there we go, there's two. The head crab home run derby. All right, I want to jump over here because I want to get health back, though. Oh, and here comes the awesome music. I don't know. I really love the music in this game. It's really simple, but it really gets you pumped for what you're doing, too. Oh my god, they're just breeding like rabbits. <laughs> There we go. Good enough. Alright. Where are you? There you go. There's one more. There you are. Jeez, I can't tell the corpses from the good ones. Right, get up there. No! Arena time. <laughs> Might as well. It's like a, it's kind of like an arena, you know, boxed in place. 
Oh, shoot. I didn't even notice my health was low. I was too busy having fun smashing the crap out of head crabs. Well, hello there, you two. Alright, let's see if we can get some back. 42, that's it. 42. Jesus. <laughs> Alright, and now comes my favorite part. The jumping puzzles. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, me, oh, my. I should probably switch to an actual controller so I have less of a problem with these. <gasps> okay, there we go. <laughs> That was close. <laughs> hey, look, computer board and a hard drive and a, a screwdriver just lying in a box. Right, I'm not gonna bother with these guys, I don't think. Actually, I think there's what you can also do is you can push these in and jump across, but only if you're really good at it. Nope, I lied. Wow, I lied. Wait, can we push you in? Ha ha! <laughs> I'm not going to bother with the barnacles. Just don't care. Just want to get to where I died. What do we do? We swim. <laughs> keep on swimming. Keep on swimming. I was inadvertently seeing that too. That's the best part. How did you die? How did both... Oh god, you killed him. Mr. Tendril Face. Mr. Mr. Oh, what's his name? Mr. Cthulhu Beast, Mr. 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 Hey, Mr. Oh, probably. Oh, Mr. Uh, Zoidberg. <laughs> oh, God, how could I forget that? Well, I'm not really that big of a fan of Futurama, so it makes sense. I mean, I love, I love the first episode. Don't get me wrong. The first episode is great. First episode's amazing. Whoa, God, we almost fell off before even getting to the puzzle. But after that, it's like, uh, the first season's okay, and the other seasons are just not that great. Okay, ready? Saving time. You don't see those other two. Saving time. Good. <laughs> now if we die, we're coming back here, not all the way back at the beginning. Oh, see? See? what I say? what I say? Who died? I died. <laughs> Told you it was going to happen. Okay. Okay. There we go. Nope. That's two deaths. Well, three deaths on the same puzzle. Let's let's keep a count. Why don't we? Okay. Okay. Two more. Whoa. I got bounced back by the thing. Okay. Only three deaths on that. That's not that bad. What are they even up there for? That's the other question. I can see no reason. Oh god, I think this is... I keep I keep going around these corners expecting a uh, head crab zombie to pop out because they used to... Like I was saying uh, in the last couple of videos, they used to pop out around the corners and that's what would freak me out. And I'd be sitting in the living room of my house because we only had one computer at that time. And I'd be like... Ugh. <laughs> Everybody else would be like, oh, are you okay? What, what's wrong? And it's like, nothing, Mom. I'm just playing a scary game. <laughs> okay. And now, that's the end of the chapter. So, uh, I don't know. I, this might be a short part. This might not. I don't know. Uh, I did not actually keep time. I should probably do that for the next episode. But in any case, I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Half-Life Source with Mio X Take it easy.